First you get that money, then you get that power. What is going on YouTube? It is your boy King R and welcome back today boys. We're hopping on to some Destiny 2. The Destiny 2 Nightfall this week is easy. Think, think, think God. Um pretty simple. The cooldowns on your on your grenades and shields and melee attacks are increased so you could just keep popping your grenades as long as you want in, inside this nightfall so depending on what kind of character so depending on what guardian you have if it's a warlock if it's a hunter or if it's a titan you want to use a specific sort of nade so you can see i'm doing it with my warlock and i popped up my solar grenade and it is completely devouring and destroying them and i'm using the dawn blade you can see me pop the super right about now just completely melt, destroy, run through it. I feel like Titans. Um, I feel Titans have the best guardians for this nightfall this week because the striker class for the Titan has a grenade where you can double stack it, double stack the pulse grenade, and it just keeps firing and firing. And I do have this great exotic launcher that it does actually help. This nightfall wasn't too bad. You, you don't want to get hit by these lights. These lights will set you back a little bit. There we go. Using the grenades once again. Not too bad. Not too bad. The supers recharge very quickly. So make sure you guys use your grenades. Use your shields. Use your melee attacks. And use your supers anytime you get them. Because you will get it quickly. This nightfall will be the easiest nightfall to get racking. I know last week was pretty tough to get the racking. Nearly impossible to finish it within 5 minutes. Um, this week is pretty easy. You only have you guys have 21 minutes to do it. There's no time. You can't get extra time anywhere. I don't think you need it. Um, you should be able to run this nightfall with with an extra with extra minutes. I think we were we were fooling me and Salt and D were fooling around a little bit too much in this, but <clears throat> we did it on our Titans first, and we just completely destroyed them with our grenades. We put um, we used a striker subclass, and we used the pulse grenade, and we just completely destroyed them. Just very simple. If you guys want me. If you guys want me to run the Nightfall with our Titans and show you guys how fast we can do it, please drop a like and leave a comment down below. As you see, we just pop these healing rims and start reviving each other. Very, very simple. Grenades, soul grenades. I have the Sunbreakers on to believe extend the duration of my solar grenade to do more damage on the enemies. <clears throat> Otherwise, it's pretty self-explanatory. Just keep using your grenades. Keep using grenades, your melee attacks do extra damage, um, and your healing rifts. You just oh, look, I already have another one, and I just put it down. And you can see right here, big boss, someone pops a nade on him, and he gets destroyed. Basically, how it go. Alrighty, boys, we are hopping into the last part. Alrighty, Pyramidon, however you say it, whatever this guy is, we have to destroy the Genesis mind. So, basically, I believe he spawns three times before he starts roaming towards the middle the first time he will spawn on that side and then i think he spawns behind you and then to the left um in his little cage that he has over there so you would just want to step on these templates to activate you want to step on this temp these both of these templates there's one on each side to um to release the shield that he has over him and then you can start launching it's really um i think it's really hard to get your grenades onto um this boss just because he moves around a lot so it does take a little bit but again it's it's a very easy nightfall so as long as you can land it on his feet you can see you're gonna try to see me throw it like on his body which is wrong um so you want to land it on his feet like just like that so you're just gonna keep moving my, my suggestion is to wait till he gets still but you can see i just threw a grenade and i already have one me not realizing that i have so many grenades um so when he does respawn he's going to be immune just like he did right there he will be immune in about a couple of seconds so i was trying to save my nade but really you don't really need to save your nades you can just keep throwing them because you keep getting them. the regen is insane so there he goes pops another shield so ads are going to spawn on the left side and ads are going to spawn on the right side so all you got to do is just step on the template and that will help that um we did die a lot so that's why it did take a long time we're fooling around um not taking it not taking it that serious but you do get melted to be honest with you so if if, if you're not paying attention um he will destroy you just like that boom three shots and you're done put in the dirt okay so we're activating the second template he pops his super because you get the super i pop my healing rift but there's a lot of ads and he does a lot of damage the boss does a lot of damage with his line rifle so there we go stepped on the two templates so now he's activated to shoot for um we're gonna shoot him here but he's gonna spawn on another cage i believe behind us so there you go 
and then he's gonna fall in there so that's the last oh never mind all right yeah all right so he didn't spawn in the cage so that was just just the last area he teleported to until he goes towards the middle now until he's, he's towards the middle he's just gonna start roaming around and start killing you um there's barriers around the map that disappear and i believe it goes into the circle clockwise so you want to make your way around the map towards the right not the way i'm going right here because there's no barriers to cover you so you will just die just like that so you want to keep your way with the barriers you can see them on the on um, on the screen over there towards the right um so we both die here which puts it a little tough on our teammate but that's all right we have three minutes left no worries um i believe we, we could do this I believe you could run that you could you could definitely run this with having six plus minutes if you're trying to go for the racking if you do not have the racking i think this is the nightfall to do it boys um pretty simple there you go we spawn in the middle where all the ads spawn there you go the melee attack takes out the whole overshield boom you kind of want to focus ads but the later you get into the nightfall so we're at two so we're at two and a half minutes more ads will spawn and it will get it's starting to get scary i think we almost almost beat it with a minute um with our warlocks but with our titans we had above five minutes i think it was like six minutes and 20 seconds again if you guys want to see the titan run with me and soul and d we're gonna do a um a, we're gonna do a fast run we're gonna do a speed run with our titans if you guys want to see that please stay tuned drop a like please let me know if you want to do that and there we go if you can land your nades on this guy you should be golden so as you can see, I think I die one more time before this ends because I think Solon goes down right now. You get slammed, bang. Oh, there he goes. Pop my healing rift, but what are you going to do when he's going to spawn on you? Try to throw my grenade under, but there is just too many ads to clear. So I believe at two minutes, they, they res I believe at two minutes, the ads respawned. So here he goes. He revives him. Teammate revived Soul and D. I get revived, and I believe we finish him off right here. Boys, that is a nightfall. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoyed. So, if you're using the Hunter, use the Arc Blade, the Titan. Obviously, you're using the Pulse Grenade, Striker class, and then the Solar Grenade for the Warlock. Um, that's a Dawn, that's a Dawn Blade subclass. All right, hopefully, you guys did enjoy. Please drop a like if you did. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. And like always. And if you are not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. And it's been your boy, King Aaron. Peace.